All right, in this video, you're going to learn the difference between present mode and edit mode in Google Slides. So both have their own um, uses, um, and I'm going to go ahead and go over those with an example of just kind of a really blank template of Google Slides. So the mode that you enter in, if you've been giving editing permission, if you see this screen here, is uh, edit mode, obviously. Um, you have to be the owner or be assigned as an editor of the uh, slide in order to be able to see this screen. So if you access a Google slide and you see like it says view only in this general area and you don't see any of these, then you have to make a copy of that document file, make a copy of whatever you want to edit yourself um, in order to become the editor of that slide. Um, otherwise, you won't be able to do any editing. So if you are in the edit mode, then this is the mode where you are able to manipulate and change. Um, so like if I create an assignment in Google Doc or in Google Classroom and I send it to you, then you will be allowed to have editing rights and you should see the edit screen. So this is very useful if I want us to have, you know, I want you to make a uh, new slide and I want you to add some stuff to it and turn it in to me. Okay. So So then you are in edit mode and you are able to edit it. There is another mode called presentation mode. And in presentation mode, there are a few things that are pretty useful, like um, it can add captions of what you are saying to the bottom of the screen. Um, sometimes they uh, use wrong words, like the transcript is not very accurate, but for the most part, um, it pretty much catches everything that you're saying if you enunciate and say it pretty clearly. Um, you can turn that on and off, um, as well as pick where the text goes and the size. So I can, for uh, hearing impaired people, can easily see what I am saying if I make the text large and I speak slowly because not too many words can fit on the screen. And so then that's just captions. I can also use the laser pointer to show like if I really want to enunciate something, this is the equivalent of having a laser pointer that, oh, I really want you to see this word right here. Um, also, I can see notes. So if the speaker has any notes, and I can see how long I have been um, sitting on this particular screen. And uh, I can make it full screen so that way nothing is showing. I can press the escape button and get out of full screen and present mode. So anyways, there are, um, you know, I can download the slides from here as a PDF or, or a PowerPoint slide presentation. I can print and you can auto advance. So that means if you press this play button, it will automatically go through the slides. And you can, um, there are some tips. You can pick how fast it, it splits between the slides and if it just keeps like looping through them. So present mode is when you just want someone to see, like I can't click on here and text and change any of the text or any of the images, but everybody, I can see and easily, you know, go through the presentation and see what's on there. So that's the difference between edit mode and present mode. So if you are in present mode, it's because you are just supposed to view the document or the slide and not make any changes. And if you are in edit mode, that's because you are being asked to make some sort of changes um, to the presentation itself. Okay, so that is all there is to know about the present versus the edit mode in Google Slides.